We are here, we are here, we are here. On this amazing day. Okay everyone, this is Cam Jones, FX Daily Analysis, and we are marking up M-E-G-L stock. We are on the monthly time frame. Price action on the monthly time frame is a bullish green candle with the long wick up to the top. So we have price action overall higher highs. Price action overall lower lows. Midpoint in the middle. On the weekly time frame, same candle. On a daily time frame, same candle. On the four hour time frame, we do have price action as a bearish red candle with a spike down to the low of second level lows. So this can be a support for that market to tag this area here and then work his way back up through that midpoint line or this can be price action breaking the midpoint line so we can follow up with the retest candle and then market work his way down further or we can receive a price action candle that's within this current price action candle and to work his way sideways so reading from the second last candle to market Second last candle in the market spiked up to the high. Price action pushed that market down and broke the midpoint. On a three hour time frame, price action is a bearish red doji. Second last candle is also a bearish red doji with longer wicks. So what the market is identifying is second last candle spiked down and then price action worked its way sideways uh, within the second last candle and price action second last candle is tagging that area of that support so mark is forming some type of double bottom with two pushes down to that area on a two hour time frame price action bearish red doji second last candle spike down to the low price at a uh, third last candle pushed up so what the market is doing, price action pushed up to the top of that high, of higher highs. Second last candle has uh, broke the midpoint and price action has came back for a retest. On the one hour time frame, price action is a bearish red doji, second last candle bullish green doji. So we have two dojis waiting for that market to see if it's gonna break out this area. So what's happening is that the fourth last candle in the market has pushed up. Third last candle pushed down to the overall midpoint. And price action second last candle works its way sideways. On a 45 minute time frame, Price action on the 45 minutes, a bearish red doji, second last candle spike up to that uh, high, more like a retest. Third last candle pushed down, second last candle pushed up from the fifth, can fifth last candle in the market. So what's happening is that price, so price action started off at second level highs, pushed up to the highest high of that area. Third last candle came back down, broke the midpoint second last candle in the market came for a retest price action works way sideways price action is within the second last candle time market is consolidating with price action second last candle and third last candle on a 30 minute time frame starting to receive some structure below or near price action 
So we can be we can be receiving that coming down in red for the first leg, second last candle, second leg uh, price action is the third leg. So we're waiting for to see if we're going to receive a bullish green candle. If so, Mark is coming up from that W, so it's breaking off that midpoint line of support. Or if we receive, we do have the engulfment pattern to the second last candle, price action to the second last candle, but may need to engulf the third last candle a little more for that structure to form. So what's happening is that uh, price or the market came down, second last candle is a retest, receiving the engulfment pattern, the price action the second last candle can push that market down further, at least to second level lows until we see what the market's gonna do. On a 15 minute time frame, price action on a 15 minute time frame is a bearish red doji indecisive. So it can be an area of support because price action also with that doji has a longer leg. It look like at the bottom as support. So it could be tagging that for that first leg, second leg, third leg. It can be respected here. And then market pushing up for that W. If not, we can just follow up with the break retest and then market push it down to the previous area. On a five minute time frame, price action on the five minute time frame is a bearish red doji indecisive. So let's see what's going on. So market's still reading the same as well as the earlier time frame that we were just on first, second, third, and then looking for that pattern to see if it's gonna be respected for that doji. So we're looking for it after the doji, looking for a bullish green candle, bearish green red candle. You see that market's gonna push up for that W. If not, if it's a bearish red candle, we're just gonna re still receive um, that break. Market came back to retest, so it's more like a double top in that area. So we're looking for that first leg, second leg. So market broke for that second leg. Market came back for the third leg, and then we did receive the engulfment pattern to the second last candle, but price action is the doji, so we don't know if it's gonna be support. Gotta wait for the market to still do what it do. So market can be coming from a double top if we receive a bearish red candle or a pattern after the price action. On a three minute time frame, we're in the same thing as well. But just the only thing changes instead of a bearish red doji is a bullish green doji. Same structure. And on a one minute time frame, we can see that support was created at this area. So overall, first leg, second leg, market came down for the third leg. Also received a break and retest, looking for that engulfment pattern for that market to push up. But price at second last candle in the market didn't receive an engulfment. Price action is a doji indecisive. We're gonna see what's happening at this market. So we don't know if this market's gonna come back for, if this market's doing that um, break of that area, come back for a full retest to that midpoint line to form a pattern for that market to push down further to the, from, to the previous side. Please study Forex pattern cheat sheet, breakout retest strategy, Okay, guys, this is Cam Jones, FX Daily Analysis. Thank you for watching, and thank you for your attention. M-E-G-L.